streets. Yeah. Heavy in machines, they know who it be. Yeah. We sell it by the ground, we flood in the streets. Seagull officially squashed his beef with a skinner. No. I think it took Seagull to take some licks in order for him to humble himself a little bit. And I'm not saying that Seagull was this ag person. You see what I'm saying? But he had his day where he's put his hands on people. You see what I'm saying? Like, when Jay-Z had beef, he was on it. Like when D-Block and Rockefeller was one, when D-Block had beef, when Jadakiss had beef with Jay-Z, Seagull was on that. See what I'm saying? When Nas went at Jay-Z and Ethan, them, Seagull was on that. When them guys tried to rob Kanye, Seagull was on that in the street. See what I'm saying? They called him the Broad Street Bully. We still call him that to today. Right? Seagull went in jail, as we all know. What happened when he came out? You know, Seagull got shot, lost one lung, so his voice is not the same. So it's like when he raps, it's not really making the same impact. But his legacy is cemented. So what I'm saying, like, as far as him as an artist, it's sharing me growth when a man says, you know what, I'm going to put my differences aside and squash the beef. But what makes this even better is that he's coming out with a state property project. That makes this even better. That makes this even more exciting. Because Philly was one regarded as being a perk in hip hop, period. And I think the fell off a lot because there's been a lot of internal fighting going on in Philly. But now, the chain's gonna get stronger because guys like Sigma are putting the differences aside and they're working together. Cassidy and me, Gilly and them guys, they can put the differences aside, they can work together. That's gonna be a victory for Philly. That's gonna help them as artists. So I like the space that Seagull is in right now. When I look at Seagull right now, I see progression. I see a man that's growing. I see a man that's matured mentally because he could have easily retaliated against Meek or Meek's right hand man when he sucker upon Seagull. Seagull could have easily retaliated, but he put that aside. So it's sharing me growth and yes, it took some humbling for Seagull to get where he is. But here we are. He's collaborating with Askina. He's got a state property project coming out. Now, there's one more thing I want you guys to listen to, right? Lady Gaga, her dog, Walker, was shot by two robbers on Wednesday night in Hollywood at 9 o'clock. Now, this is what I'm saying. Like, if you're working for a celebrity, you need security. That's what that shares me. You're not even safe. Because you got people that's gonna trail you now. Because they think you got keys to the vault. So that's got me thinking like I'm saying, that's crazy. But based on what sources are saying and the feedback I'm getting in the news is this. It was a brazen robbery. You see what I'm saying? And the robbery was calculated. They knew who they were targeting, but they knew what they wanted. But the dog walker put up a little fight. The two robbers came and said, look, give the dogs up. The dog walker, he refused to give the dogs up. So that's when they shot him in the chest. And he started screaming, help, 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 help. But his injuries are non-life-threatening, which is a good thing. But for anybody working for a celebrity, you're gonna have to get yourself some security.